Thank you. One little boy in the North County has a great story to tell about how he was born. His parents tell our 10 News anchor Lindsay Pena they tried to make it to the hospital, but that little guy had other plans. I'll definitely bring him back and then we'll like we can pull the hose line out. Some cookies for the firefighters and paramedics here at Fire Station 41. Tom and Sydney Judge wanted to thank them for helping deliver their little Heston a couple weeks ago who just couldn't wait to be born. I just underestimated how how fast he was going to come. I still thought I had at least another six hours of labor. Mom and dad tried to make the 30 minute drive to the hospital. But at some point during the journey, um, I had a Sydney shout out over to me, pull over, pull over, so. <laughs> Tom had no choice but to get on the phone with the 911 dispatcher and coach his wife until help could arrive. We didn't know how close we were to a fire station. We yeah. just were hoping that they would find us as quick as possible. And luckily they did. Firefighters and paramedics saw things were happening fast. Next thing you know, I was catching a newborn baby boy. Came out perfect. So mom did all the work. It was a, a healthy delivery and, and we were just fortunate to be, I think, in the position to assist, you know. Um, she did a great job. Little Heston now happy and healthy and clearly unaware of all the commotion he caused. But one day, he'll know the story. Right. This is like a movie, this is um, yeah. a, a kid been delivered in a car, so. A movie with a happy ending. Lindsay Pena, 10 News. That father's really, really calm. I know this is much later, but I, I would have freaked out Wouldn't completely. You? you know who else was calm? The dispatcher, I listened to the 911. Yeah. He was like, be careful, the baby will be slippery when he comes out. <laughs> I mean, it's just like, like he'd done it a million times. Yeah, it I'm was sure great. they have. And I'm, I'm sure, sure they, they have, sadly.